Hi guys, this is Erica, and in today's video I want to talk about how to stay focused in the reality that you want to experience. But before we start, I want to remind you that we are giving away a free course called How to Find Your Blogs to Manifest Anything Fast. All the details are down below. And also, if you would like to work with me one-on-one, -on -one, I would love to help you manifest anything that you desire. I'm really good at finding the reasons, the blogs of why you're not manifesting. Um, I have a sale going right now. If you're interested, all the details are down below. And I also have a couple of affirmation tracks and courses that are really good to manifest commitment, manifest a specific person back. Those ones can really help you manifest, like keep you focused. See how we're talking about staying focused? They will keep you focused on to manifest faster. So yeah, all the details are down below. But let's start with this video. So I think it's super important that no matter what we are wanting to manifest, a specific person, money, a job, a car, whatever it is, I think it's super important to stay focused on that desire. Because remember, all the power is in the now moment in your mind. And if we are already experiencing a 3D situation where, that we don't like, for example, your specific person that you love and adore, you want to be with them, they tell you, I'm not ready to be in a relationship right now but you want that relationship. I don't, I'm not ready for commitment, but you really want that commitment. <sighs> Your job is to, first of all, remind yourself that you're the one who's in control and stay focused on commitment. This person is committing to me, period, right? Stay focused on that. And don't allow the three D circumstances to keep you thinking here where all the power is that they don't, they don't want commitment. So that is your job to stay focused on, no, they're committing to me, period, because I'm in control, because they don't have free will. And I will stay persisting, persistent in that assumption that they're committed to me until it hardens into facts. Like you never used to say, until I experience it in the 3D. Right? So it's so important to stay focused and not allow the illusion, the 3D, to keep you thinking in here that it's still the same. That's why Neville used to say, be blind to the senses, go within. Meaning, we know what the 3D is. It's just old thoughts, assumptions, fears manifested. That's it. It's, it's the old story. It's the world of shadows. Everything is dead. So... Your job is to stay focused. Now, I wanted to share a story. Maybe you've heard it before, maybe not. But there's a story that uh, when Neville used to be in the military and he wanted to be discharged, honorably discharged, because he knew like if he just ran away, like he could go to jail and he didn't want that. So what he did, the first thing he did, he did it according to, you know, <laughs> human 3D, circumstances or whatever you want to call it like he did what he had to do he filed a, a a form right saying i want to be discharged and of course it was denied so he's like okay well then what am i gonna do i'm going to use the law of assumption i'm going to manifest it so what he did he will go to bed and you know in the army <laughs> um while he was in the army he will go to bed imagining that he was at his home with his wife with his baby in in new york in his apartment in new york he did this i think it was for uh eight or nine days so that's what he did and what happened was that uh the person uh the sergeant the person that will give him the uh discharge him the, the one that will give him the, his discharge papers, he called him to his office and he's like, well, do you really want to leave? And he's like, yes, give me, the, give me the reasons why. And he will give him the reasons. And he's like, really? But anyways, like long story short, he got discharged, honorably discharged. So you see, he did not allow the 3D circumstances to keep him thinking, I'm stuck here. And if he had to stay years, apparently. But he didn't want to stay years. He wanted to be home, but honorably discharged. So 
he didn't allow the 3D to keep him thinking here, I'm still here, I'm stuck here, I have to stay here for more years. He, he went within. He loved imagining, but you don't have to imagine. You just you can just affirm throughout the day. If you like scripting, you can script at night before you fall asleep. But it's all about staying focused on what you want. If you want that commitment, stay focused on no matter what they told you, even if they told you, I don't want to be with you. Stay focused on this person is committed to me. Like Neville did. He stayed focused on I'm, I'm sleeping in my apartment in New York. I was discharged period. Apparently he had a friend that was there with him and like he told him what to do and I guess he was a psychologist and he's like no like <laughs> this is what I have to do right like I, I this is where I am this is where I am so I just have to deal with it. So he allowed the 3D to keep him thinking I have to stay here I have to stay here and that person in comparison to Neville he stayed for, I don't know years and Neville stayed another week and he left. So see the difference? Neville didn't allow the 3D circumstances to keep him thinking that he was stuck. The other person allowed the 3D circumstances to keep, keep him there. So it's the same thing for us, you guys. The same thing for you and you and you. No matter what you're experiencing, if you, that's not what you want, don't accept it and go within. Don't let the illusion, the 3D, to keep you thinking, this is what it is. They don't want to be with me. Or they didn't give me the job. Or I don't have the money in my bank account. Or like thinking of my daughter story, I think I've shared this story here on the channel. Like she wanted her car and she will come to me and I, I will be like, don't complain. See yourself driving the car. Tell yourself, I love having my, my car. I love having the freedom because I drive my, my own car. I didn't allow her. Well, I, I tried to help her to not stay focused and I don't have a car. I told her, go within. Tell yourself you have the car. And she manifested her car. Not one car, but two cars. See, so when I was manifesting uh, a job, not this one, but a different job, they they told me like first like there were no openings then i applied for the job they said no sorry you don't have the qualifications i did not allow the 3d to keep me thinking oh well it's not for me i was like i'm stubborn I, and i said no that is my job i don't care that is my job that's it i'm the best candidate period that's my job they came back to me and they said, Erica, we interviewed other people. We love you. We want to give you the job. We're going to adjust the, the qualifications. And they gave me the job. When I manifested my visa to live in the United States, I applied for the visa twice. And I said, I don't care. I don't care that the U.S. government is saying, no, deny. You don't have the requirements for you to, to go to our country, to come to our country. I could have said, oh, well, I just have to deal with it. I'll never be there. I said, I don't care. I'm going to be in the United States with the love of my life. And that's what happened. Circumstances moved for me to experience my assumption. Third time that I applied, I got my visa because the way things moved for me, I manifested going to Switzerland for free. When I applied the third time, they saw that I had traveled to another country and that I went back to Mexico. So the third time was the charge and they gave me my visa. But you see, I did not allow the circumstances to keep me thinking that's a no. I was like, no, I don't care. That is my job. I don't care. <laughs> I'm, I'm getting my visa. I don't care. And I can name many other circumstances where the 3D was telling me no and I did not accept it. I did not. So do the same thing, you guys. Whatever it is that you desire, it doesn't matter what they're telling you. It doesn't matter what you're experiencing. It's like, nope, go within. Just like Neville did. Just like I did. And say, no, <laughs> they do want me for, you know, a relationship. They do want me for that job. Like, that car, it's already mine. And that's it. 
use the power that you have within inside your mind and don't let the 3d to keep you thinking that you don't have it okay i hope that this video helped you um i intend that it helped you um i love you guys so much thank you for liking watching and subscribing bye